Hey, what's going on guys? It's Sweat. Today we're going to be talking about the fastest farming method for this week's faction rally. In order to do this, you guys are going to want to have a full set of your faction's gear. If you don't have a full set, it's going to make it a lot harder and the farming process is going to be a lot slower. So make sure you guys try and grab a full set of your faction's gear before you guys attempt doing this. Once you guys get the full set of gear, you guys should be cruising pretty easily and you guys will be getting a lot of tokens per hour. Let's get right into the tutorial. So you guys are going to want to load into Titan. You're going to try and pick the area that has a public event that is a few minutes from starting up. As you guys can see, I have about four minutes before mine's about to start. The first thing you guys are going to want to do is you guys are going to want to look at the patrols to see which one you guys are going to want to pick up. The goal is to try and do two patrols and do the last sector before the public event starts. So you guys are going to want to try and choose to see which two you guys can get done the fastest. When you guys complete these two patrols, you guys will have a times four renown stack. And you guys are going to head into the lost sector. Once you complete the lost sector after doing the two patrols, there should be a little bit of time or the public event in the area you just were is about to start. So you're going to fast travel back there and you guys are going to do the public event turning it heroic. Once you guys complete that, you guys will get another times four renown stack and you guys are going to head back into the lost sector again. After you have completed the lost sector for the second time after doing the public event, you guys are going to fast travel to the other area of the map where there should be a rally flag that has just spawned or is about to spawn and you guys are going to rinse and repeat starting with the patrols again. One quick thing that I'd like to note is that if you guys come across a world boss, a yellow bar that spawns one of those chests after killing, it will give you a times two renown stack. You guys can replace that with doing a patrol or you can add it on top to get a times five renown stack, but I would not recommend going out of your way to kill a world boss. It is not worth the time. If you guys happen to die in any of the lost sectors and you lose a renown stack, do not go back outside to try and get your renown stack back up to four or more. I would just recommend finishing it and just starting fresh, keeping the cycle going. Assuming your runs are going smoothly, on average you guys are going to be finishing a cycle in which you do the lost sector twice and a public event in about 7 minutes. If you guys divide this by the hour, you guys are going to be able to do this 8.5 times per hour and if you take 8.5 times the 21 tokens you guys will be getting, you'll be getting almost 200 tokens per hour which is absolutely insane. The really nice part about this strategy is that it can be done solo and it can be done in a fire team. Obviously doing it in a fire team is going to be faster and more efficient, but you still are able to get a lot of tokens solo per hour. That's it for the tutorial guys. If you guys found this short, sweet, to the point, and if you enjoyed it, make sure you guys feel free to leave a like on the video. Uh, subscribe if you guys are new here and you want to see more cool content. Uh, and we'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.